hello my seekers welcome back welcome back to the channel it is always such a blessing to have you right back here today's reading is for Aries Aries my darling it is your day to shine please shine bright like a diamond also please make a note that if this reading does not resonate to your present situation please do not get hurt offended or even in your feelings honey it just simply means that this reading is not for you today, but if you come back a different day, that one just might be. Also, if this is your first time here and you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please feel free to subscribe, y'all. Turn the post notification on so that you will never miss any of these readings, all right? Also, give the videos a thumbs up because when you thumbs up the videos, YouTube will see that you like the videos. And they will push those videos out into a much wider audience and the channel and that particular video will grow, okay? So go ahead and thumbs the video up. For all my returning seekers, please know that I love you guys so, so, so much. Thank you all for the love and for all the support that you show. I see the love and believe me, I am embracing all that good energy. All of it, every single last minute of that energy, all right? Also, please make a note that the card has been shuffled and the card has been blessed. But before I get into the readings, I always have to pray first, y'all. So just let's get into a prayer and then we'll get into our reading, okay? Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send down your most powerful angels to take charge over today's reading. Using my body as a vessel giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share with the seekers, only for the ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I'll give you all the honor and all the praises. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 All right, my darlings, let's jump right into your reading. And if this one does not resonate, please know that I do have a playlist for you, Aries. So go ahead and check that playlist out. I'll just come back a different day because I do upload at least three videos every single day. All right? Go ahead and follow me on Instagram. The link for the Instagram will be listed in the description of this video. All right, my darlings, let's see what angels are saying here. Angels are saying here, I still want that future with you, okay? Someone is saying that they still want a future with you. Maybe something might have happened for you to question someone's loyalty here is what I'm feeling here. Maybe an incident may be occurred where someone is just saying, you know, I'm not really sure was what, where, or what direction that we're going in right now. But through it all, I feel like inside someone is really wanting to work things out and still have a future with someone here is what I'm feeling here. Angels are saying here, I'm afraid what will happen if I surrender to you, okay? So you're afraid. Someone is afraid of what might happen. Something must have happened for you to have that doubt. Is what I felt in your first card. Someone is questioning if this relationship is worth the sacrifice, the pain in the past. I definitely feel that there was some kind of a pain that someone met and endured um, and have them feeling very insecure within themselves as far as moving forward and staying in that relationship is what I'm feeling here. Someone is really questioning um, their position is what I'm feeling here, okay? The position has been questioned here. I've tried to be faithful many times. I just can't. There you go. That's the reason why someone is questioning someone's loyalty. Very, very afraid to move forward because you know this, this person was very unfaithful to you. This person had deceived you in the past, okay? And in your heart, you feel like you want to give them a second chance, all right? But you fear of, you the fear of being hurt once again, okay? I, I'm still hoping someday we'll find a way back. So the relationship has been separated, all right? Two people is definitely in separation right here. Um, but someone wants to try to make amend and to see if the connection is worth coming back together. It's what I'm feeling here in this card, okay? Someone is hoping someday we'll find a way back together. I fake it half the time is what someone is saying here, though. So get over it, right? Someone is um, feeling very, This I feel a very, a feeling of not feeling worthy of your person. Um, maybe your person did give someone a, a, a reason to fake the feeling because after all, 
the person, someone did go out of the relationship and did do something very stupid here. Really, really stupid. Which is um going and mingling with a third party here because someone is saying I've cheated here, okay? This is a reason, a good enough reason to fake, to fake your feeling because a sense of protecting your heart is what I'm feeling here. Um, someone may be feeling like they are the shit too. I feel like your person feels like they're the shit. They got what it takes to juggle two people is what I'm feeling here. If someone is saying, listen, I fake it after time, all right? You're not as good as you think is what I'm kind of feeling from that card right there. Messages, please. Hmm. I did move on, but the sex is making me sick. Yep, there you go. There you go. Your person's saying, I, I felt that, that your person is a person who feels like what they bring to the bedroom is the bomb that come. But in all nationality, that is not exactly all the reasons why I feel like you just, you decided to be with this person. <clears throat> but your person has a really strong ego here, okay? And they're saying here loud and clear that they did move on to someone else, all right? Or they, they might have left the relationship. And they seem like they are definitely involved with someone else here. Definitely involved with someone else. They were definitely not faithful here. And they have definitely moved on because here they're saying that the sex is making them sick with that other person, okay? Whoever they are seeing right now, they're saying that that sex, honey, is not as good, all right? It's actually making them feel like they want to throw up, want to gag in the mouth, okay? Let's get some clarity here because a lot of you need some clarity with this person here. Forward movement. Let's see what your person is thinking and feeling here, okay? Messages, please, angels. Give me some clarity here. Messages, please. Messages, please, angels. Let me have some clarity here. Messages, please. Messages, please. Messages, please. All right, my darlings. Um, angels did what they had to do here. Uh, the six of pentacles came through in reverse. The king of pentacles also came through in reverse as well. And the nine of pentacles came up. I also see the chariot over here. The magician came through. And the star, honey. All right. Now, in the Six of Pentacles here, um, I'm feeling that this person wasn't any much help to you in the relationship, all right? Um, I feel like um, this person might have taken your things, your money. They didn't bring anything to the table. I feel like you were struggling the entire time when you was in this relationship here. Not only were you struggling with their loyalty and their faithfulness to you, but I also feel like you were also struggling with money issues as well. Here in the Six of Pentacles in the reverse. In the reverse here in the King of Pentacles also telling me that, yeah, money issues definitely involved here. There was definitely some money issues. You need to be making your money, all right? I feel like this person made their money only for them. They didn't share anything with you. They probably I they pay their paycheck is what I'm feeling here in the King of Pentacles here in reverse, all right? They definitely had what they had. They didn't share anything with you, okay? I'm also having a feeling here in the Nine of Pentacles here that's coming through. I want you to enjoy your life, honey. It's time that you enjoy your life. It's time that you start building up your wealth. Um, working hard to enjoy your life, honey, and just being independent. Maybe on your own. That's okay. It's, there's nothing wrong with building stability by yourself and enjoying and embracing that stability, okay? That's what I'm feeling for you here in the Nine of Pentacles here. Now, in the chariot here that showed up for you, I feel, I see your possession coming through. That has to do with your money issues as well. That person did take from you, all right? I'm also getting a feeling here that you're trying to move on, but you're moving on slowly from what had happened to you with this person here. You're moving in a slow pace is what I'm feeling here. I'm also feeling that this person might want to come back into your life too, all right? So be on the lookout for that if they have not already tried to contact you. Um... I feel like you just need to focus, stay focused on what it is that you need to do to build up your empire, okay? Just go for it. Maybe you want to come up with another way of thinking where as far as your career and your money and your stashing your money is concerned. Just don't wait around any longer because I feel like you have waited enough here in the chariot on it. I feel like you have waited enough. I think you have wasted enough time, all right? 
Now, please know this, that in the magician, it's time that you start manifestation your life as well, because your life is in the direction of cycle right now for you to start building on that manifestation for yourself. Okay. You wasted enough time. I feel chasing and waiting around for someone that doesn't need to be waited for is what I'm feeling here. Cause your person is kind of caught up with who's given the best sex. All right. And you're not on that kind of a journey, on that kind of a mission right now. Because I feel here also in the star here that is coming through for you. I feel like the blessings are going to happen for you very, very soon. But you have to have your faith. Don't lose faith. Don't lose hope. All right. Paul is well. But I do see a reunion maybe coming up. Maybe with this person again. Maybe you still have some kind of entanglement with this person some way, shape or form. But I do see our a renewal of something coming towards you, honey. Now, also know that it could be a renewal with someone from your past. It could be a renewal with a job um, opportunity. It could be a renewal with something that you have been waiting for, hoping for. But I do see growth coming towards you as well, all right? So have an open mind and just remember to have faith with this situation because it is definitely coming to you and it is coming to you really, really soon, okay? Messages, please. Messages, please. Messages, please. All right. All right. I feel like you've been juggling two things. Um, At the same time, you're juggling your career here as well. You're juggling what you got to do as far as your money is concerned, but you're also juggling the relationship situation, all right? Um, your life is definitely calling for balance. No way, shape, or form. There's no even getting around it. Your life is definitely calling for balance. But it's time that you put yourself into first place is what I'm feeling here. Because as far as um the tower in reverse is showing me that um you might have been the one who just really got fed up and kind of walked away from a relationship because the tower is telling that you might have ghosted your person. But I feel when you did that, there was not really any closure when that happened is what I'm feeling here in the tower in reverse, okay? There's definitely no change though. Um, the way you left them or the way the relationship ended, they're still in the same la-la land, okay? Nothing has changed here. It's still in the same position, still stuck, but you're still trying to juggle um, two things. I feel like it's time right now because your cycle is right now as far as making money moves, okay? Just go for it. Angels are saying, go get it. Go get it here. Don't wait any, any more time. Don't waste any more time lingering because you have done enough of doing so, okay? Now, my darlings, that is your reading for today. I hope it did resonate with you. If it did, please let me know your situation chip down in the comment section. Also, remember to pray because prayer works all the time, y'all. It doesn't wait, um, work for a minute or a second or for a tickety tickety talk. It works 24 hours all day, every day for the rest of your life. But the most of all, also remember to seek first and you will always find.